And just like that, the Notch Fusion Flow appears, almost like ordering from treestuff.com. Step one, install the Notch Flow rope wrench. Depress the slick pin, turn it out of the way, put it on the rope, close the slick pin, and like many of our other devices, it's now gonna hang on the rope. Next, we're gonna need a carabiner and a prusik. Not bad, getting good at that. We'll go ahead, we'll install our Prusik here. You can use a variety of knots. You're gonna to wanna to watch that the overall length of your Prusik hitch isn't so long that it's gonna impact the rope wrench. And then you can fine tune that pretty much to your own needs. One of the great things about this setup is that there's really nothing to drop. Your pulley is contained, so you don't have to fumble with quite as many things like adding the tether, adding the pulley, and adding both legs of the Prusik that you would with a similar kind of rope wrench setup. Even with an oval carabiner here, with a little bit of work, you're able to spin it all the way around, which is gonna make it easier to clip in and out of your harness by orienting the gate opening towards the bottom. Fusion flow combo can be tended from any point on the spine of the device. And when it's time to go down, simply pulling down on the Prusik is gonna engage the fusion flow rope wrench and allow you to start moving down the rope. With your full body weight in it, it's gonna look a lot smoother than that, or you might need to adjust the adjustable stainless steel curved bollard here at the top with the only adjustable rope wrench on the market.